Day 4 of the Women's World Cup took place on Tuesday in Belfast, as the two semi-finals and a host of other knockout games took place. Find out who came out on top below. Ireland's hopes of contesting the fifth place playoff at the Women's Rugby World Cup were ended as they were unable to beat Australia for a second time this tournament, losing 36-24. The game was in the balance with the scores, tied at 12-12 after 34 minutes, but Australia powered away with 24 unanswered points either side of half-time. Australia struck first through captain Shani Williams' eighth-minute try, but Ireland were ahead when Ayla Segan pounced from a rolling maul and Nora Stapleton converted. Wing Alison Miller extended Ireland's lead after jinking through the Walrus defence. It was a level game when Sarah Ariadne burst off the back of a scrum and Ashley Hewson converted. Australia did not look back after that as prop Hilisha Samoa. Flank Emily Boyle try, and wing Mahalia Murphy ran in tries, and Hewson added three conversions and a penalty for an 11-point haul. Ireland finished strongly when Sophie Spence and Paula Fitzpatrick claimed consolation tries in the final six minutes. Earlier in the day, Italy secured their place in the ninth-place playoff after a Melissa Bitoni score and Mitchell Ocillary brace saw them run out comfortable victors over Japan. Spain booked a place in the ninth place playoff against Italy with a routine 31-7 victory over Hong Kong at Queen's University. The game was finally poised at the break with a score line of 14-7, but Spain pulled away in the end with Isabel Rico, Amalia Urbana, Ira Echeberria and Carlota Mellas each registering tries.